It's now mid-July, some six weeks since we last saw the garden. Here we have the tomato. You can see we have probably a dozen young tomatoes on this plant. Obviously it's still too green to, to pick, but in the next couple of weeks they'll be ready. I'm quite impressed by these peas. The peas that have been one of our best crops. We've been picking these peas now for about two or three weeks and there's masses of amounts of peas on here, all ready to be picked. Good quality, fresh peas. As you can see, the lettuce have been a spectacular success. These are the Alo Rossos and they could have been picked any time in the last three or four weeks. But they've got loads and loads of leaves. Absolutely astounding. These are what's left of the iceberg lettuces. As you can see, masses of amounts of leaves and they actually taste quite, quite delicious. Here we've got the aubergine plant. This is the only aubergine plant we've actually got, but as you can see, these are the beginnings of the actual aubergine uh, fruit. It won't be ready for another couple of weeks, as you can see from, from this here. Tomatoes plants now have fully formed fruit. If these were to be picked now, they would naturally go red and ripen on their own. But what we're going to do is keep them on the plant a little bit longer so that we can, we'll, we'll, what we'll do is let them mature on the plant instead of off the plant. In that way we'll get bigger, juicier tomatoes. Here we've got a truss of tomatoes. Now, what will happen in the next week or so these plants will have to be supported by fairly solid canes because these tomato plants can grow up to five, six, seven feet tall. Here we've got the pepper plants. Um, these are doing spectacularly well. I mean, some of the fruit that we've already picked off of these plants is actually that size. These are superb, ready to eat, all organic. And we're really impressed with these. Excellent. Action. These are the cucumbers. Look at the size of these. Just waiting for them to go that colour before they can be picked. So I think Jay's going to leave them uh, on the plants for another week or so and then we'll be picking them and hopefully eating them in our salads. On this table we've got the next generation of plants which will take their place hopefully in a couple of weeks, maybe a month or so. So we've got herbs here, some young uh, pepper plants and chilli plants over there and the tray of, let's have a look, cress. Um, here we are in the herb garden. Some weeks now since we saw these herbs. Parsley, sage, rosemary. I think there is thyme somewhere. You can see beautiful, beautiful foliage from one plant. This is just one parsley plant. We've been taking strawberries off these plants for about four or five weeks now. Um, just after the last filming, we started cropping these strawberries. There's no fruit left. Somebody's, some people have had all the fruit, which is what it's there for. 